Hello YouTube, welcome back to another Let's Play Resident Evil 4. Last time, if you remember, I got out of this, t I went into the tunnel, and now I'm going out to see what adventures I'll behold. And there's a zombie, or, yes, yeah, or so I believe a zombie. Now you have to watch out in this level, because there are bear traps freaking everywhere. So it's best to shoot them out before you even go on ahead. And they have dynamites! Yes, that's right, they have freaking dynamites. But, the good thing is that, uh, you can, if you kill a zombie with a dynamite, the dynamite will blow up and kill the other guys with them. So, yeah. It's kind of a backfire thing for these guys. But don't worry. Don't feel alone, cuz. In the game, they try to give you a sporting chance. So, they give you grenades as well. No, grenades work like, like shit. The only grenade that I think is good is the, uh, flash grenade. Or as I like to call it, the holy grail grenade. Yeah. So there's a lock. You have two choices, well three. Knife it, shoot it, or kick it. So I don't feel like kicking it, so I'm just gonna walk right through. Oh, that's why I never explained these. Uh, typewriters can, uh, save your data. Okay, that's enough for that. So, yeah, I'm not gonna save it now. And here are some wires. Yeah, you guys have to see that. Those things are freaking loud. So, we go in here. What the hell? I hear a banging noise. The last time I saw a wardrobe was the Chronicles of Narnia. But since I have a gun, I'm safe. We open the door. And oh my god, it's a dude! Who the hell is this guy? Not really. Yes. No. You? He doesn't even say it. He doesn't even answer that question. Okay. I have only one very important question. You have smoke? I got bubblish gum. Oh my god, the guy with the pitch fork. The big cheese. What? What in the Leon never even heard that expression before? Yes. Oh shit, it didn't work. Whee! <laughs> so in chapter 1-1 one, one of Resident Evil 4, so I'm not going to save and we go on ahead. What? Let us give you our power. No thanks, I have a dose of power this morning. Oh, hell no. You better not inject steroids into me. Doesn't intoxicate mean, like, drunk or something? <laughs> what the fuck? Wake up. For you. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Don't call me a bloke. Easy, whoever you are. <sighs> Name's Leah. Came here looking for this girl. She's hot. I've seen her. What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Yes. Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. President's daughter? Not really. <laughs> it's too good for a guess. Want to start explaining? No. Psychic powers. We are just like, what the fuck? I'm just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something. 
Oh crap, it's got an axe. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. Cool. Used to be a cop in Madrid. Now I'm just a good for nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. I bet you are. Why'd you quit? Phew, <laughs> policia. You put your life on the line. Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Hey, I appreciate it. hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. Hey, I killed robotic ninjas so for a living, okay? Only for a day. It turned out great for me. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. Cool. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Oh, shit. What the fuck are you supposed to do? Booyah! Oh, sorry, Lewis, you lost an arm. <laughs> oh, no. Ow. I didn't even have to use my gun that time. Oh, God. I don't really want to be put up with that, so we're walking. And... Are you gonna rape me? You know what? I'm a man. I can take it. Hey, that was the merchant, by the way. Got something that might interest you. Oh, really? <laughs> Is that stuff illegal? Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. So now we're what gonna go selling? buy stuff. Because we can. And I'm first I'm going to give him my Hello. shotgun. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank and that was actually it. Thank yeah, then. I'm going to show you something awesome. That is right. The freaking hand cannon. <laughs> but of course, with such great weapons, there has to be a downfall. You have to purchase all the upgrades, and the upgrades cost a lot of money. You need a cheat. I love shopping. So, that's right, folks. The hand cannon. Max out, and good to go. I think this is all the items I'm going to need for this Let's Play. If I'm going to need more, then I'll just buy some more. Although I just bought all I just bought Gracie at a store. So yes, after two pointless videos of really nothing, I'm sorry for showing you nothing. This is Fort Griswold. I don't know if that name has already been stolen. So, I don't think I'm going to have enough time to raid this place, so next time, me and the hand cannon, well I'm going to demonstrate the hand cannon for y'all, on these freaking zombies!